I've never been this excited about a shift knob before. So check this out. This is from a company called We Are Likewise. It's an interesting name, but they make really good products, really cool looking products at least. This is the Thick Boy, because you know, your boy, your boy's a little thick, so I had to get the Thick Boy. And then this is the extension I got. This is the Rod Stewart. Um, it's chrome, and that's about all I can say about that. <laughs> and of course, I had to pick up the Ford adapter. So basically, I'm just gonna remove the current knob just to kind of see how it's going to all go together let me see how it goes on looks like okay perfect I do it in reverse because I need to be able to feel my lockout in this case the lockout is way too I guess it'll still do it but I don't like the positioning of it so I'm gonna give it a couple twists counterclockwise get a little bit more play in that beautiful I should probably lock tight that but I'm not going to right now Okay, so then the next thing is we got to get the extension. So then the idea becomes that the extension goes on onto the adapter like so. And then you get the actual knob itself. So like I said, this is the thick boy. It's got the likewise font on it. Uh, focus, there we go. This is heavy. So we would just put this on top like this. Screw it all the way in. And so that's the idea. Now, here's where I'm a little conflicted. I like the knob. The finish on the knob is fine. It matches the finish on my trim, right? But what I feel is a little weird is the extension itself. This is a chrome finish which you know what here in the car doesn't look bad I actually kind of like it but I have plans for this chrome and this entire dash that I can't talk about too much right now so needless to say I'm gonna go get this powder coated which brings me to the adventure of today 12 seconds later shout out to the PT Cruiser for going faster than me sorry that i'm driving too slow y'all but you know your boy i ain't that fast 20 minutes later i've got a pretty bad rattle coming out of the door panel too actually let me see if you guys can hear it dude that thing is so bad i'm gonna have to take apart that door panel at one point too and see if i can figure it out it sounds like it's some cables I don't know for sure though. Anyway, still driving. An hour later. You know what sucks is traffic. You know what also sucks is when bull old cars like this mother Corolla from who knows what mother year gets in front of you and eternal happiness. There's a Lamborghini Aventador in the color orange in front of this Corolla and I can't drive behind it because this mother decided to cut me off and drive in front of me. What a And then to make matters worse, he's breaking from like a mile away, man. Oh my goodness. I just want to be a Skittle with my Lamborghini brethren and you are not letting me. Please move. Yes, thank you. Oh my goodness. Look at this Lambo booty right here. Mm -hmm. What a delight. Now, I'd never get a Lamborghini, probably because I don't fit, but Marley loves the Lamborghini, and this is an Aventador, so I'm sure she'd love it too. We'll see how uh, we'll see how my little my little things turn out. I'm getting the hood prop that I put out at car shows, and then the little extension rod. Um, getting them taken care of, powder coated, matte black. These are all the color samples, and then mine is going to be uh, I think one of these two down here. Those blacks right there. Let me pull back a little bit. Yeah, one of them. But yeah, man, check them out. Follow them. Velocity powder coating. 
Instagram, Facebook, they do essentially everything that can be powder coated. Wheels and random stuff. Two hours later. We are going to have to come back to this shift knob another day because that extension is currently getting powder coated. I've gone ahead now that I've gotten home and I've been home for a little while. I've gone ahead and I've placed the adapter on it and I've Loctited it. So now it's a matter of letting that sit and dry before I get to put the thick boy on it. It has been a long, long day and I'm finally home. We're getting ready to go shoot shift talking here in a little bit over at AJ's house, but stay tuned because I'm super excited about this knob. That's what she said. And uh, we'll, we'll see. I mean, I'll keep you guys posted. At the very least, being able to put the thick boy on would be dope. Like, I'm really excited about that. What started off as an unboxing ended up becoming a day in the life. And I just wanted to thank you guys for coming along. See you soon.